Wow. Triple G just put Ryota Murad in the dirt. <laughs> okay, so uh, Gennady Golovkin uh, defeats Ryota Murad via uh, ninth round TKO. Uh, Murata's corner stopped it. Uh, he caught Murata with a beautiful overhand right that just sent him to hell. And, you know, that was it. Uh, first first five rounds, I had Murata up. Uh, Murata applied pressure back, Triple G up. Really, really worked the body. It looked like Triple G was on his way out. He looked old. Uh, it looked very similar to the fight with Sergey Defrenchenko. I, that's definitely a chink in uh, Triple G's armor. He can't fight going backwards, and he really, really struggles when his opponent goes to the body. Golovkin, who turned 40 the other day, there was questions about was Triple G past it, hadn't been in the ring in, what, a year and a half, and his, his last couple opponents were lackluster. And Ryoto Murata, you know, Olympian, I think he was a gold medalist, um, was a tough test. Triple G passed it. Now, that doesn't mean he's ready for Canelo Alvarez. I got Canelo Alvarez stopping Triple G, beating the dog shit out of him. If you watch the fight today, you will understand, like, as far as, like, high level, I'm not sure Triple G can beat any high level boxer at this point in his career. But B level, C plus level, oh, Triple G's beating your ass. And, and, and it showed tonight. Murata Murata is a, is a B level fighter. And he really has no plan B. It's come forward, it's throw a lot of punches, supply pressure. And with Gennady Golovkin, really, really educated jab, good, good angles on his punches. And, you know, probably one of the world's best chins ever and yo he he definitely showed me something he knocked the mouthpiece out in round six and after that he just went in he just went in just uh to the body to the head to the top of the head he just mixed up the attack well and you can start to see real Murata. He, he's, you can start to see his body language he looked dejected he, he didn't have the same luster on his punches and it just the velocity wasn't there he was on his way out and if we know anything historically if if you on your way out triple g's gonna get you out of there they're like he doesn't let you off the hook no triple g is one of the best finishers in the history of the middleweight division now we could say that that competition has somewhat been lackluster but be that as it may he is so, shouts out to Triple G. Great win at 40 years old. And I'm not looking forward to the Canelo fight, but I mean, it is what it is. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. YSM Sports Media, we out.